what is up everyone welcome back to my channel i hope you guys are doing well today for today's video as you guys can tell by the title we are testing out the new madison beer x boohoo collab as soon as i saw that this was a thing the other day i just knew i had to try it out for you guys i absolutely love madison beer's fashion sense and i love a bit of boohoo so it was a no-brainer i know that madison beer has actually collabed in the past on an asos collab i think as well but i'm not too sure i tried that i don't think i did so i thought this would be a super fun and fresh video so I hope you guys enjoy if you guys are brand new here and you guys haven't seen my face before hi I'm Roxy welcome to my channel if you guys want to stick around make sure you guys subscribe down below but I guess if you guys want to see the Madison Beer X Boohoo collab on yours truly then without further ado let's get on into the video okay so first things first I want to give you guys the down low on like the prices I actually got five different outfits like complete outfits how they were styled on Madison Beer I actually spent about 200 and something pounds on these items so I feel like they're still pretty affordable and I did manage to get five whole outfits as you guys can see I did get the collab in two different orders that is because when I made this order some of the things I wanted to buy were out of stock but then they restocked it so I placed another one I guess we'll start off with the smaller order which is the outfit that went out of stock pretty much first I feel like it's one of the faves out of the whole collection so the first outfit is this one right here and she she looks stunning. I'm living for this co-ord set. It's like a little knitted co-ord number. You can actually get the cardigan and the skirt together as one piece, but then you have to get the top separately, which is a little bit weird, but this is how it looks. It's giving me very much like skims kind of vibes because of the fluffy sort of material. As you guys can see, the skirt is super high-waisted. It's got a little slit as well, and I just love the fabric it's made out of. Oh, they even did the little label on the inside. It says Boohoo X Madison Beer. It looks pretty pretty high quality like the whole thing so far we then have the little cardigan which is a little cropped cardigan like this there's not really that much to it it's made of the exact same fabric it's actually got really big pockets on the front of it which I definitely dig I love anything with a pocket and yeah that's the little cardigan and then lastly I did order the little crop top to go with the whole outfit which like I said you have to get separately I was so lucky that they restocked this in my size because it is so freaking cute to look at it. It's like a little fuzzy bralette. It feels so nice. This is the kind of thing that you definitely won't really be able to wear a bra with because this is what it looks like on the back. So I would suggest either like sticky cups or nipple covers with this because it doesn't really have an awful lot of padding in it. It's probably not going to be as supportive but I do have to say the straps are adjustable so that's always a good start. So let's try this whole outfit on and see how it looks. Okay guys so here is the very first outfit and what it looks like on. I have to say I am just obsessed with this whole vibe. It is so cozy but so put together at the same time. This bralette is really comfortable. However, it is quite small. I feel like it's not really supporting anything whatsoever because the underneath of this fabric, it hasn't got like a strap holding it in or anything like that. It's literally just loose fabric. The only part that's kind of got a bit of structure and support is this part right here, but I feel like that's not really enough. This is kind of how it looks off the shoulders. I really really like this kind of vibe. I am really self-conscious that I'm like flashing you guys though in this top because it is so tiny. I'm not gonna lie, I was a little bit worried that this outfit would be kind of made of like the kind of fabric that's a little bit itchy, you know, like the fuzzy fabrics that kind of just scratch you. But actually this is super cozy. It feels really comfortable on. Honestly, I have nothing bad to say about this whole outfit apart from the top. Like the top could be a little bit more supportive, but it's not the end of the world. I just paired this whole outfit with cute little nude kitten heels to match. These are from Shein if you're wondering. But yeah, the fit of everything is pretty good. Like the waistband feels nice and sturdy of the skirt. I like how high the split goes. It doesn't go too high up at all. And in general, I just feel really, really cute in this whole outfit. So I'm giving this a 10 out of 10. Okay, let's crack on into the second parcel. I'm really excited to see how everything looks on me in this one because there was a lot of things that I probably wouldn't normally buy, but because it's Madison Beer, I just had to. Okay, the next outfit we are gonna be trying is this one right here. And again, I'm obsessed with this outfit. She looks absolutely stunning and I love the color of the set. It is kind of made of like a blue satin sort of fabric. I love it so much and I love the color. I actually ended up getting this not exactly in my size. I got this in size 10, I think. Yeah, this is in size 10. They were out of size eight, but I'm hoping it's still gonna fit. I really wanted to try it for you guys. So here it is. This is the 
the skirt. As you guys can see, it's got like little straps. I'm pretty sure from memory you kind of like tie this around your waist, I think. And then the top half is like this. It's kind of like a shirt sort of moment. It's very cropped. And then around the cuffs, like as you guys can see, the cuffs are sort of split, but they also have these little strings that you can tie around it to kind of cinch it in. I'm not gonna lie, it feels pretty nice. Like the fabric is nice and thick. It doesn't look see-through and yeah. Can't really fault it. I would say this type of fabric is very prone to creasing though. So don't mind the creases. Obviously, if I was to wear this out, I would probably like steam it or iron it. This little cord was actually on sale. I got this for £42.50. So I feel like for a whole outfit, that is not that bad. So let's go try it on and see how it fits. Okay, so this is the next outfit and what it looks like on. I have to say, I'm not like in love with it. Now, obviously I did get this in the wrong size. This is in size 10. So I did actually have to cinch it in at the back quite a lot. I don't know if that's down to the sizing, but this was very wide, which meant that it kind of just sat on my hips instead of my waist. And in the photo of Madison, she's wearing the skirt very high waisted. I have noticed that there's slight differences between what I've received and the photo of Madison wearing it. For example, look at this slit in the photo of her wearing it, it is like the tiniest of slits ever but this one is a little bit more cut out than I thought it would be. I mean, it's not a big deal. It's not a massive slit anyway, but it does look different to the one that was in the photo, which makes me think like, is she actually wearing this outfit or was it a different version of it? The actual fabric quality feels really nice on. It's not see-through. You can't see like my underwear line or anything like that. So that's really good. Now again, I don't know if this is down to the sizing, but I have noticed that Madison's top is a lot more cropped than mine. I guess it could be down to the fact that she's wearing a smaller size, but. I kind of wish it was a little bit more like fitted and cropped because then you'd actually be able to see this tie effect underneath. If I sort of relax like this, you guys can probably see that this whole like tie effect is completely hidden, which kind of defeats the point. To be honest, I don't know how I feel about this one. Let me know what you guys think. I kind of still feel like it's not very similar to the one that Madison was wearing. But yeah, I still think it's a cute outfit. So I'm gonna give this like a seven out of 10. Okay, so this next item is another one that literally sold out within minutes when I first went on the website to try and purchase these things for this video. It is this dress right here and oh my god. It was so popular. I feel like it's because Madison Beer wore that particular dress on her Instagram when she announced the collab. I mean, I love that dress, but it was sold out in every single size, which I was gutted about. However, lucky me, I actually found out that they have this exact dress, but in a longer version as well. So the one that's in the photo of her wearing it is the like short one, but this one is the midi version. Literally the only difference is that it's a little bit longer. Like the top half is exactly the same. The fit looks exactly the same. So here it is is oh this is cute it's actually made of a fabric i did not expect it to be made out of i don't even know how to describe this you know like when you went to school and you wore school trousers they were kind of made of this fabric i don't know what this fabric is but this is exactly it. I've never ever seen a dress being made out of this particular fabric, so that's really interesting. As you guys can see, it's just a little black dress. It's quite curvy. It's pretty cinched in at the waist, so I feel like it will fit quite well. It's got a really long slit on the front on the left side, which is really cute. And then the actual like trimming of the dress is this white stretchy kind of trim, and the straps are also made of the same fabric. They're super like, Super stretchy, as you can see. On the back is just pretty scooped. So honestly, I'm really excited to try this on. I really liked how it looked on Madison. So let's give it a go. Okay guys, so this is what the dress looks like on. I have to say, I'm in love with this. It fits so freaking nicely. I actually feel like I am snatched at the waist. I'm loving this slit so much. It is so perfectly placed. It's not showing too much, but it's showing the right amount of skin. I'm not actually wearing a bra with this dress and I feel pretty supported with the kind of like bust area of it. The straps are actually really, really stretchy as you guys can see. So that definitely helps a lot. The actual shape and outline of the dress is literally perfect. It has a zipper like down the side here. And I feel like that really helps to kind of cinch it in as well. I'm actually really happy that I got the longer version because I feel like it just looks so much more glamorous than the shorter one. This is what it looks like from the back as well. 
I think it's so nice. This is one of those little black dresses that you just need in your wardrobe. You could totally dress this down, dress this up. I feel like you could wear this for so many different occasions as well. So I'm literally loving this. I think you guys can probably already tell what I'm gonna rate this. This is definitely a 10 out of 10. Okay, moving on to the next outfit. We are trying out this one right here and I literally bought every single piece that went into this outfit. I bought the trench coat, I bought the crop top, and I bought the trousers, and they are all absolutely gorgeous in color. I can tell the fabric is gonna be really decent as well. So first up we have the crop top. Let's crack this open. Everything in this particular outfit is kind of made of like a denim fabric, so it's quite like rigid. There's not really much stretch to it, and this is what it looks like. It's just a really simple boob tube. It's actually got a zipper in the back, which is really nice. As I said, it hasn't got any stretch to it, so it'd be really hard to get on otherwise. We then have the trousers. These are just kind of like oversized boyfriend slash mum style jeans. These are kind of like cargo jeans because they have all these utility side pockets, which I think is really cool. The front is what really kind of gets me. I like this little effect that they've done with how it kind of looks like it's undone, like the jeans are undone and just folded over. They're pretty high-waisted, which I'm really liking. They've got pockets and I love the color so much. Like I love white denim. As you guys can see, they're super wide on the bottom. So I don't know if I'm gonna like them because I'm not really a fan of like super wide leg things, but we'll see. And then the very last item we have is actually the trench coat. Now this is kind of where I feel like it gets a little bit much because it's literally a whole outfit made of the same fabric and the same color but it is cute. It is really, really cute. I like the quality. It's literally made of the same fabric as everything else. I feel like I'm not doing it justice by holding it up, so you guys are gonna have to see how it looks on. But yeah, it looks quite big. Let's just say that. So as I bought these, these were actually on sale at the time. The trench coat was 38 pounds. The top was 15 and then the trousers were 29 pounds. I feel like for the quality that they are and like the whole fit, it actually is pretty good in terms of price. So let's go try this whole outfit on and hopefully it won't be too much. Okay, who is she? I don't know who this is right now, but whoever it is, she means business. I feel like a literal angel in this whole outfit. And I have to say one thing, okay? I love it, but are you guys seeing the color of it versus the photo? I feel like whoever graded this photo or edited it or whatever kind of needs to be fired because this is like a nude beige warm color Whereas this is white, like it's full on white. It is a completely different color to what I was expecting. Not that I mind because I'm obsessed with this color, but if you were ordering this and you were expecting a beige outfit, you'd be pretty disappointed. Now let's dissect the outfit. I mean, I thought this would be a lot and don't get me wrong, it definitely is. Like this is beyond. It's very full on, like from top to bottom, you are drenched in this denim fabric. But for some reason, it looks so bougie. Like I could see myself wearing this in New York if I was like a model, like Gigi Hadid or something. It is so cute. The jeans literally fit like a dream. I don't know what it is, but I'm obsessed. Dare I say it, I actually like how wide they are. I never thought I would see that day where I actually like wide jeans, but these are pretty cute. I really like them. The actual top, again, in the photo, it looked a lot more cropped. I feel like it kind of just looks like a jumpsuit, does it not? This this part of the top right here is so long that it's covering and overlapping the top of the jeans and in the photo of Madison wearing it, that didn't happen. She can't, hers was kind of more like cropped or like this, but I feel like if I pull it up anymore, it's literally gonna be under my chin. I'm not gonna lie, I am roasting in this outfit. This coat is actually kind of warm, so I feel like for the autumn time, this would be great. As much as I love this outfit, I'm not sure if I'm gonna keep it because, well, let's just say, I don't know if I can trust myself. This is a whole white outfit, like one drop of food or drink on it and it's game over. But let's enjoy the moment while it lasts. I am obsessed with this outfit. So if you can trust yourself with a full on white outfit, definitely purchase this. I'm giving it a 10 out of 10. And now the very last outfit is this one right here. As you guys can see, she has gone for an oversized grandad kind of vest, which I've got right here. She does also have this oversized white shirt, which is also part of her collection 
section underneath it. So let's crack this vest open. I don't think I got this in my size. I think they only had it in a larger size. Yeah, so I got this in a size 10, whereas usually I would probably get it in like a size eight or maybe even six, just because it's already quite oversized. But this is how it looks. It's not really the color scheme I would usually go for. Like I don't really wear black all that much, but it's cute. And then we have the white shirt. I feel like as far as white shirts go, it can't be that exciting, but I'll show you guys anyway. So here it is, here's the white shirt. Is this gonna be see-through? I guess that's really the only thing that I'm wondering. Is it see-through? It's kind of see-through. I can see my hand through it, but I mean, if you just wear some nude underwear or little shorts underneath, it'll be fine. So yeah, without further ado, let's try this last outfit on and see how it fits. And this is the very last outfit. I don't know about this one, okay? I don't know if I'm vibing with it. I like the vest, don't get me wrong. I think it's a nice fit and it feels nice quality, but the shirt underneath is not doing it for me. I don't like how it cuts out here. I feel like it kind of just looks like a massive diaper. Do you know what I mean? Like the shape of it at the bottom is just not it. I really thought I could make this outfit work, even though it's so not my style, like the color scheme and everything, but... I don't know. What do you guys think? Let me know in the comments. I just don't know if I can pull this outfit off in all honesty. I just feel really like not me in it. Do you know what I mean? This is what it looks like on the side and the back. I feel like the shirt is definitely a little bit see-through, but I did wear nude underwear underneath. I think I'm gonna give this outfit like a five. It's just not really my style. I just, I'm not vibing with it, okay? All right, guys, so that is everything for today's video. I hope you guys enjoyed seeing what I picked up from the Madison Beer Collection. I feel like I got pretty lucky with everything in this video because everything sold out so quickly, but I still managed to get most of the things I wanted in my size. Let me know down below which one of these outfits was your favorite. What do you think of the whole Madison Beer collection with Boohoo? Obviously there is so many more pieces to the collection. I just kind of picked out the ones that she was wearing in photos so you guys could see how it actually looked on her versus a model. I think my favorite set is definitely the fuzzy coat. That is so me. It's something I would wear anyway and it's just so freaking cute. If you guys enjoyed this video and you guys haven't seen my face before, make sure you guys subscribe, stick around, join the dinosaur family family and also give this video a massive thumbs up. Thank you guys so much for being here. I really appreciate every single one of you. I hope you guys are having an awesome day. Make sure you guys watch my latest video that's about to roll in the end screen, but I'll see you guys next time. Bye! Mwah.